Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh, brothers and sisters. <laughs> what are you doing? Why are you laughing like that? Subhanallah, how beautiful our deen is. <laughs> the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam says, In qala subhanallahi wa bihamdihi fi yawmin mi'ata marra huqqat khatayahu wa in kanat mithla zabad al-bahar. Allahu Akbar. He says, whoever says subhanallah wa bihamdihi in a day, 100 times, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will forgive that person's sins, even if the sins are tantamount to the scum of the sea, the scum of the sea. You know how great that is? Allahu Akbar. This hadith is narrated by Bukhari and Muslim. How long does it take to say subhanallah wa bihamdihi a hundred times? One, just one. One hundred times. It takes less than a minute to say subhanallah wa bihamdihi a hundred times. Less than a minute. Or less than two minutes. And because of this, based on the appearance of the hadith, being hopeful to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala can forgive all of your sins. Allah can forgive all of your sins. And look, this one's bothering me while I'm recording this beautiful reminder. <laughs> so, try to practice this, inshallah. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant us guidance. Just a hundred times, less than two minutes, anticipating for Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's forgiveness for all of our shortcomings. And inshallah, hopefully thereafter, coupled with that, increasing in good deeds. Fastabiqul khayrat Race towards goodness Race towards goodness Race towards goodness Inshallah embrace this beautiful practice Subhanallah wa bihamdi A very easy tasbih Subhanallah wa bihamdi Glory be to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala And all praises are due to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala A hundred times Inshallah Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala Through the messenger sallallahu alayhi wa Has promised us that he will forgive all our sins, even if it may be equivalent to the scum, the foam of the sea. Assalamu alaikum. Fi amanillah. Kuli fi amanillah.